Hello and welcome back to more Hearts of Iron 4. I don't know how I haven't done it yet, but I've never played Fuhrer Reich. Or in this case, Fuhrer Redux, because Fuhrer Reich isn't being made anymore. From what I've heard. By the way, it's not updated yet. As with any new mod, you're playing Germany first. I hope the song from the title screen wasn't copyrighted. Well, I'll find out. For those of you who don't know, Führer Reich is a mod about what if Germany lost World War I, but from the perspective of Kaiser Reich, where Germany won World War I, because there's a event where a book gets written about it. Uh, somebody want to tell the Germans that their tanks probably need to have guns in order to work properly? How am I making a tank without a gun? I'm quite certain this is the one without a gun, right? Oh, looks like Spain starts off uh, in a civil war quite early. As in the beginning of the game. Oh, whoops. Rip Lennon. I don't know what this new focus tree is going to be. So the plot was exposed. I think I think we know which one of these I have to do. After what I did a few games ago with Herman Goring, he he needs to go. He's done some terrible things in Africa and another universe. Kingdom of Portugal declared war on the Portuguese Republic. Uh, where's the Portuguese Republic? It, I found it. <laughs> the Portuguese Republic is in the colonies. Well, they have cores. Why are they down here? How is this going to work? Oh good, Goring's dead. The Ottomans aren't feeling too good. Oh, oh hey, and uh... The British Raj is at war with Afghanistan. Oh, and India's here. Oh, the Kingdom of the Netherlands is back. Uh, join us or die. Good boy. Always a stock market crash with these mods, isn't it? Why can't the stock market ever be stable? Why can't they get a news article? It's like, stock market stable. Wow. Thanks, Adam. Now I don't have to deal with this stupid treaty. Didn't even have to do a decision for it. It's just dead. The tape holding Brazil together has broken. Not even they want to go to Brazil. Chaos and Kiel, that sounds like a good thing for me. Oh, oh, hold on. First, I gotta appoint a new economic minister. Uh. Sure, let's go with the Austrian man. I'm sure there's nothing controversial about him. Otto Strasser has fled to the Kiel zone. What's he doing there? Uh. Oh! Holstein intervention! It'd be a shame if someone to, were to, uh... intervene. Oh, I got a choice here. Uh... Well, nobody's backing Denmark currently, so, uh... Over Kiel and far beyond. Just fucking go. And the Danish get nothing, because I'm invading them. And the Denmark is gone too. The Swiss offered a deal to the to the French over us. Cease thine tomfoolery. Denmark has just changed their name and color without my permission. Though they are still my puppet. And Volkist. <laughs> they're being allowed to continue their... Yeah, they're being allowed to continue this part of their tree, even though they are definitely not... They definitely don't have a left-wing coalition anymore. <laughs> oh, Denmark. 
First India, and now Insul India. What's Insul India? Oh, it's the, uh, it's the East Indies. In which the Indian War is not over yet. Finally time to get a little expansionist. The Kiel Zone doesn't count. Denmark started it. I swear Denmark started it. Don't look at me like that. Support the Indian struggle. I wouldn't call it a struggle. The Indians are winning quite handily. But any chance to fuck over the British for now. Okay, the Spanish Civil War has ended, but there's still two Spains, so, uh... There, yeah, there we go. That's what I thought. It ain't over yet. I wonder if we can get Sweden to be our friend. Sweden, you want an empire again? Oh, they're national populist. Oh. Ah... Some things never change. Oh, they really never change. That was quick. Krazub. What? What the hell is a Krazub? I don't know what a Krazub is, but I gotta support it. My coup in Austria is successful. What do the French think of it? Oh, hey, I get all their units. I'm going to damn the Danube. I'm sure that everybody will be happy about it and there will be no ecological damage whatsoever. Oh, Ukraine has declared war on Poland. Uh, gonna hold off on damning the Danube for now and, uh... Probably... Oh, do we... Hmm. Yeah, go for Poland. France has declared war on the Swiss Confederation. Or the Switzerland. Or goodbye, Switzerland. France supports Polish sovereignty. Hmm. And the Poles refuse to drop their claims. Well, I appear to have, yeah, I've drawn uh, Ukraine into into a war with France, haven't I? <laughs> How long does this war go last? 1940. I can wait. Yep. Ukraine's at war with all of them now. <laughs> sorry, Ukraine. Not sorry. I may already have a war goal against Poland, but if I push them more, will they yield? Uh, Hold on a second. I gotta take a detour to Hungary. They want my boot up their ass. Hungary, you can kindly fuck off. Uh, and they have no troops on the border. Here I come. <laughs> Complete overkill. And they imme <laughs> Slovakia immediately capitulated. <laughs> uh. Oh my god. Poland surrendered when I did that focus. <laughs> I'm sorry, Ukraine, but uh, no war today. <laughs> uh, you'll get it back some other time. Huh. Huh. Hungarian puppet. Slovakian puppet. Oh yeah. Cozying up to the British is working. You're gonna be fucked, France. <laughs> the British have accepted our next proposal. Trade deal on military goods. It's all coming together. Trade deal accepted. Oh yeah. Now I just need to wait for them to be at war with France. That'll come later. Hmm. 
Do I demand a Rhineland referendum or demand Bohemia? Let's do Rhineland. Well, the United States has won their war against Mexico. What's gonna happen? Oh, I just released a puppet. But Krazub didn't get their claim. I supported Krazub so much, too. All right, demand the referendum. Hmm. I don't want war yet. I want to at least try for Czechia. Ugh, they take the stability yet. Oh well. Well, I'm running out of options, so it's time to demand German Bohemia. Bohemia has ignored the ultimatum. Ah, uh, you poor thing. Nope, oh, time for war. You bastards, they bombed the dam! Because I haven't finished constructing it yet. And there goes Czechia. The former terminally ill man of Europe. Not just sick, terminally ill. Uh, sure, you can be my friend. Oh yeah, look at this encirclement in the Rhineland. There's so many troops there, a lot of them foreign. Time to invade Belgium. Goodbye, Belgium. Oh, I've crossed the French border. I have brute forced my way into Elsass Lothringen. <laughs> the Maginot Line can go fuck itself. It ain't got shit. Oh, I almost forgot about Luxembourg. Oh, wow, I, I killed Luxembourg so fast that they didn't join a faction. Don't mind if I do. Oh, hey, I broke through the Italian lines. Well, the French invasion is going swimmingly. Oh, I can, I can actually make it over into Zara from here. I didn't... That's one hell of a naval crossing. Okay, I guess I'd better set up an offensive line there. I just go all the way over there. Oh, oh the Kingdom of Kurdistan has capitulated because Turkey declared war on them. Uh, I have no stake in this game. Oh, that's the state of their front lines. Okay. Turkey. Italian government flees to Tripoli. You motherfucker. The French army flees from Paris. At least they didn't flee from the continent. God damn it, they flee to Algiers. You motherfuckers. Ah, the fate of France. They may have fled, but I still get to divide up their country. Well, the United Kingdom didn't join the war in time, and I guess I didn't need their help in the first place. Oh well. So, uh... It's my puppet. The Volkists want to conduct their ceremonies inside of Notre Dame. Well, as you don't know, uh, the Volkists are, uh, very pagan. Like, more so than the Nazis were. <laughs> That's what they plan to do inside of the church. You know what? Go for it. Well, Switzerland stands alone, so... Only thing one left to do about it. Wait a minute, I don't think that was a sentence. Only one thing left to do about it. How did I say the words in the wrong order? <laughs> what a slip of the tongue. Okay, something's been happening in India, and I didn't know about it. Why the fuck does India look like the HRE? <laughs> what is happening? 
There goes Switzerland. What the fuck do I do about this? Oh, the dam is finished. Oh, hey, Spain has declared war on Portugal. Krazub wants to join the Stell Pact. I wish you would have asked sooner. More the better. Krazub. The Holy Empire of Krazub. They changed their name. <laughs> uh, no. No, you're... You're not getting your territory back. It's mine. You little puppet. The gall of them to ask. Oh my god, Portugal's winning. What? I have identified an issue with my puppet government in Italy. They don't have cores on anything, which means that they don't have any manpower to garrison it, which means critical infrastructure like airports on the Mediterranean are completely destroyed. How am I supposed to bomb the navies without those? Eh, shit. The initial successes of Portugal against the Spanish Soviets uh, did not last forever. Rip Portugal. Oh, hey, the United Kingdom is at war with France and Italy now. Finally. I think that means I can do this focus. Yes, I can. What am I doing currently? Expand naval bases. Fuck that. Alliance with Britain. I need your navy. Wait a minute. Britain's already cleared the seas. I can start a naval invasion. Britain refuses. What? Spain won against Portugal and the Soviet Union took it all. <laughs> Throw up. I did it. I navally invaded. They only had one unit there. Ugh, I can finally end this. There we go. French Republic gone. I just had to capitulate what's left of the Italians. And Italy's gone. And the war is not over? Hey, who the fuck do I have to capitulate next, then? Who's left? It, the Philippines. The Philippines are a major in this war. Uh, why are the Philippines a major? Are they at war with? Okay, they're at war with everybody else, so I guess I just gotta wait for somebody over here to kill them. Great. Oh good, the United Kingdom has made a landing in the Philippines. This will, should be over soon. Why is the Philippines a major? Ah, it's over. The Philippines capitulated. Uh, time for this peace deal. God, there's so much to do. Alright. I think I got what I want. I'll let the AI handle India. I forgot they were in the war. Why do I own this? I didn't select this. What? Alright, the puppets have been released. Africa is a mess. On purpose. It's finally time to tackle the east. I've been putting it off. Where is it? Here we go. War with Belarus and Ukraine. I think I'll just go to war with both of them. Wow. The Belarus fell quickly. And they're gone. I, I don't know why, but Ukraine had a piece of India. You know what? You can have that. You can have that back, India. I don't want it. Actually, no. Better idea. Deliver it to the British Raj. <laughs> yeah, there we go. British Raj lives on. Oh. I can annex Sevastopol. Well, sure, it's quite strategic now, isn't it? 
it's time to finally destroy the Soviet Union. The way you end most games of Hearts of Iron. Bye bye, Big Red. Time for German dominance. God damn it, Turkey's getting invaded but again. Where's Turkey's army? All I see here is Bulgaria. On the United Kingdom declared war on Yemen. Bulgaria has declared war on the Hellenic Republic. Well, they got more units on their border than Turkey. All right, Moscow captured on the Leningrad and then uh, probably over there. Oh, you know what I should do? I should start using that strat where I, where I do a collaboration government with the Soviets in order to get their capitulation time, their capitulation limit down. Hmm. It appears that the Soviets have decided to burn everything and leave past the Urals. Do I end it here or keep going? Eh, it's 1945. I'll end it here. I didn't even take Leningrad. Or whatever it's called in this mod. It might not be called that. I didn't check. <laughs> yeah. Wow. I was actually planning on giving some land to people. Um, why do they still own Georgia? The Soviets just couldn't let go of Georgia, could they? Well, they can keep it. Well, with the Soviet Union's defeat, I think that's enough for now. There's still the war in the Balkans. I'm not standing around for that. We reign supreme. And surprisingly, Italy has not exploded out of Italy. Despite their inability to garrison because they don't have cores on anything. I think the mod needs some polish, especially with the current patch, because, uh, like, the plane, the, the tree for the planes, uh, it still gives you research bonuses on specific models, which don't exist anymore. And I'm pretty sure these basic small airframes have nothing in them. You know, with that, I will see you all next time.